So we are at Walt Disney World in Florida for our 10 miler tomorrow morning. And we were slightly not prepared for the rain that is potentially going to happen. So we decided to go to the local Walmart and Braves and Rapids there to see if we could find some really cheap ponchos and possibly a shirt that we could just toss out. So what we found was we found two ponchos. These were like four dollars and a quarter a piece. So they're just plain uh, clear ponchos that we can just take off whenever we actually start running. But these are mainly for the 30 minutes to an hour that we're going to be waiting before the race starts at five or before our corral actually starts at who knows what time we're in corral two. So maybe we'll get started around 5.30, 5.45-ish, we'll see. But that's mainly what those are for. And, and with the rain, it has cooled off a little. Uh, so we wanted to get a long sleeve shirt because I, when I was packing, totally was not thinking about it being cool during this run. So I left our throwaway shirts at home, smart. So we wanted to get maybe a shirt to throw away. So I did find, I actually may not end up throwing this out. I might just end up tying it around my waist to keep it um, because it was like $9. Um, so just a sweatshirt for me. <laughs> Brandon's is actually really funny because he has the same sweatshirt. But then as we were walking back towards the front of the store, we walked through the women's section and there was a sale sign for a dollar. All these clothes on the rack were a dollar and I don't. So I kind of made a joke. Hey, you can just get a women's shirt for a dollar and have and throw it out. And of course, Brandon's like, okay. So he found this lovely deal. It's quite large. <laughs> so Brandon's going to wear this and we only paid a dollar for it. <laughs> and we'll show you a picture of him wearing this. <laughs> so we've got our ponchos that we can just take off and, and throw out and shirts that we can potentially do the same thing with. Um, and honestly, I may grab some extra uh, trash bags from our hotel room here and tie it over my shoes depending on how hard it's raining in the morning and try to keep my shoes as dry as possible for as long as possible. So, have you ever come to a Run Disney event or a Run event anywhere and forgot to pack your rain gear? Let us know in the comments below. What did you do to solve your immediate problem? Let us know. And until next time, remember, stay safe.